welcome to Jenny Fit Start, your go-to fitness channel for active seniors and beginners. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're going to have a great workout today. I'm going to take you through a 30-minute workout using your bands. Now, you can have the bands with the handles or the bands without the handles. Either one's going to do fine. Even if you don't have a band, grab a pair of hand weights and you could follow along with this video too. So this video is going to combine cardio and strengthening. We're not going to stop. I want you to pace yourself, have fun, and let's get started. All right, y'all. Is everybody ready? Let's get started. This is going to be a great workout. I want you to start with your band, whether you have handles or not. What we're going to do is get it nice and tight. Give yourself about, I don't know, about two feet in between. Make sure it's not loose. Make sure it's nice and tight. And we're going to start with a knee lift. Great job. Now your goal is to try and touch the knee to the band. Come on, get high. Try hitting the band. Now don't cheat y'all by bringing the band lower. I want you to keep it at 90 degrees. The arms stay still, but the knees keep going. Let's go. I wanna take you through a nice full body workout, y'all. All I want you to do is pace yourself, do what you can, and have fun with it. Let's go three more sets. Come on, knees up. Yes. Fantastic. Up. Good, here comes your second set. Go. Knees up. That's it, that's it. Come on, hit that band. See if you can make it shake a little. All right, last set, make it the best one yet. Come on, up, up. See if you can try and keep your abs in. Chest high, yes. And four, and three, and two, and you're done. Good, keep your band tight like this. We're gonna lift it over our heads. And what I want you to do is pull down for two and then up for two. Down for two. Good, can you do it with me? Down for two. These are called lat pulls. These work the big triangle muscles in your back. Good. Speed it up, down and up. Down, check out my elbows, y'all. You see how they're coming right by my rib cage? Pull, pull, yes. Now let's slow it down. For two, try and squeeze the shoulder blades in the back. Yes, pull down. Do it again. Now we're gonna speed it up, come on. Go eight. Seven. You should see the band growing as you pull it down. It gets longer as you pull down. So we're gonna get through one more set. Slow it down. Down for two. Good. Hope you're feeling great so far. Let's go. How about one more? Now let's speed it up. Here we go. Down and up. Down and up, down and up. Four, three, two, and one. Great job. Let's shake out the arms. You did a great job. So we're gonna move on to our next move. We're going back to knee lifts. I want your arms 90 degrees. However, the move looks like this. Try it with me slow. Across, across. Can you see the difference in this one and the last one we did? I'm twisting my band to the side and my knee comes across the body. Now speed it up, go. Yes. This is a great cardio section. It also gets the hip flexors. And guess what else it gets? Those lower abs. Who doesn't want that? I know I do. 
You're doing great. Keep it up. Really try and feel your abs as you're adding the twist. Come on. And maybe smile. It's not bad. Fantastic. You have three more sets. Eight, seven, six. Try and get your knees across your body. Good. Set number two. Come on. Yes. Keep up the good work. Don't forget to breathe. Always breathe. Here's your final set. Maybe you'd like to count down with me. Eight, seven, six. Could you count louder? Five, four, three, two, and shake it out. Yeah. Y'all are awesome. All right, shake it out. Grab water if you need it. If not, I'm going to go right into the next move. The band comes behind your back. Now, get it way up there. Tuck it under your armpits even. What we're gonna do are called chest presses. Kinda like a bench press, but with a band. Let's start with our right arm. Push. Good. Now check out your wrist. Are they straight? You should not be over bending the wrist in any way. Keep going. Now it's important that you let the resistance work on the way back. In other words, don't let it pop back. Bring it back slowly with any of our moves. Now speed it up. Here and here. Punch and punch. Good. That's it. So I'm going to add a little bit of lower body cardio to this. Watch this. Down and up. Down and up. Good. So we're pushing forward. I like this. This feels great. Two more sets. Go eight. Seven. Come on. Six. Maybe you want to bend your knees a little bit lower. That's up to you. What do you want out of this workout? Another set, please. Down and up. Down and up. Good. And four more. We're going to keep our legs steady and change the arms a little bit. Hold it here. Okay, what we're going to do now is both arms. Keeping the lower body steady. If you want, you could have some hips side to sides. Sometimes I do that. Two more sets, eight, seven, chest and shoulders is what we're working. Good. Another set, come on. Yeah, push, push, push. I feel one more set after this. You can do it, come on, stay with me. Last set. I'm really proud of you guys. Keep up the good work. A little exercise is better than no exercise. Five minutes is better than no minutes. Now listen up. Singles right and left. Here and here. Here and here. Good. That's it. And four more. We're gonna add the lower body cardio again. Are you ready? Down and up, down and up, down and up, down and up. That's it, down and up. Two more sets and then we're gonna move on, come on. If you don't want to add the lower body movement, you don't have to. Good. Let's 
So we have one last set. Watch the tiny change. Go across your body. Go across your body. That's it. Only four more. You can do it. Three, two, and one. Shake it out. Good. Do you need a break? Take it if you'd like it. Maybe you want to keep moving. Maybe you feel great and you want to keep going. All right, y'all. What we're going to do is we're going to keep the band behind us. What we're going to do, keep it behind our back. This time, our elbows stay down. Our palms are up. Down, two, up, two. So what we're doing, y'all, is giving our arms a break. Just giving our arms a break, but we're still holding the band. Now speed these up, please. Go down and up, down and up, down and up. Good, that's it. Good. So I'd like to add a tiny bit of an arm movement. Down and up, down and up. Is there a lot of resistance right now? Not really. But it's kind of fun to add some upper body movement. It works our coordination. Good. In and out. In and out. That's it. I would like to do this two more sets and then move on. How's that? Come on. Now, if your knees don't love a squat, what could you do differently? Well, you could lessen the movement. You could do a teeny tiny knee bend, or you could just take it out, or you could do a heel lift. You decide. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and shake it out. Amazing, y'all. How are we feeling? If you need water, go ahead and grab it. All right, I'm gonna move on. What I would like for you to do is now step in the band with your left foot. Your right foot is on the outside of the band. An underhand grip, right and left, up for two down for two. I want everybody to go slow first so that you feel what you're doing and you can concentrate on your form. Now speed it up. Go right. Go left. Go right. Go left. So I'm going to do four more and then I'm going to change my left leg a tad. Watch this. Excuse me, my right leg a tad. Now I'm pointing my toe down. All that did was shift weight to my left leg. Good. Now if you would like to try something a little higher level, lift up the leg. Lift up the leg. Keep it lifted. So now you need to focus a little more. Concentrate. But you have three options to choose from. You have eight more. You can do this, y'all. Seven, you can do it. Six and five, four, three, two, and then leg comes down and we take your foot out of it. Good. All right, shake it out. Shake it out. All right, what we're gonna do is now place the band on the ground. You're putting it in a straight line. You're gonna stand to one side. You're gonna step over and here. So we're gonna step over, step over. Good. So this would be like a level one, right? You could stay here. If you're ready to take it up a notch, I'm gonna show you a level two, a little bit something higher. Watch me. Hop, 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 good. 
I would like to show you a level three so that you have three options. Now it gets harder because I bend my knees. I bend my knees. I bend my knees. Good. Now, you have your option. Everybody's going to take it up a notch. Here we go. Here, 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 here. Or you could step, or you could step tall. Either way, we're all at tempo. Two more sets. Yeah. Ooh, great job, y'all. Doesn't matter what option you choose, as long as you feel great doing it. Second set. Nice, four, three. Last set, make it the best. Four, three, two, and shake it out. Grab your band, grab your band. You did fantastic with that. We're gonna come back to it. But now you're gonna stick your right leg in the band, the left leg stays out, underhand grip, and a slow bicep. A slow bicep. A slow bicep. Good. Now speed it up. Yes. Great. Remember, don't let the band pull you down. I want you to lower it down slowly. Now here's your second set. So now we point the left toe down. Great. So most of your weight is on your right side. Yeah. Now, your third set, see if you can pick up the leg. If you can't, that's okay. Something to work towards. Working on our balance. You have eight more, come on. See if you can hold it. Maybe you should focus on looking at something not moving. Maybe you could pull your abs in. And give me one more. And relax. Let's put the band down on the floor again. This time we're gonna start on this side. And we're gonna go slow, stepping over the band. Maybe you like the speed. I kinda like the speed. Whew. However, I think we all need to step it up. So it's here, here. Stepping over the band, make sure you don't trip over it, so you gotta lift the legs up. I'm gonna do one set at an option one. Now I'm gonna do an option two by stepping low. Now I'm bending the knees. That's it. And now I'm gonna do an option three with a little bit of a hop. A little bit of a hop, good. Try not to kick your band. So we have one more set. I'm gonna let you choose which option you'd like. Go, go. And four, and three, two, and shake it off. Grab your band. Very nice, y'all, you're doing great. We're gonna move right into triceps. To do that, I'm gonna turn around so you can see what I'm doing a little better. Place your band in your right hand. Your left hand grabs the band. Your thumb is up. Now it's harder the higher up you hold, and it's easier the lower down you hold. So you decide where you want it, and then what we do is we go up for two down for two. Ooh, I'm a little out of the screen. 
So I'm gonna widen my legs, but don't feel like you have to. <laughs> I just want you to see the top of my hand. You'll notice that my palm is forward and that I'm bending my elbow. You'll notice I'm going slow, but not for long. <laughs> Are you ready? Speed it up. Go up and down, up and down. Yes. Good, your goal is to try to get your elbow completely straight. I'm very warm, how about you? You have two more sets. Let's go, you can do this, come on. We're working the triceps. These are the muscles in the upper back of the arms. That's it, that's it. If it gets hard, you can drop your back hand a little bit on the band. This is your last set, seven. Six, maybe you wanna count down with me. Five, that's it. Four, three, two, and relax. Great job, how are we doing y'all? Is everybody okay? We're gonna move right to the other side. So we put it in the other hand. You grab the band from the back, thumbs up. Now we go slow up, slow down. Slow up, can y'all see my hand? I'm gonna really squat down so you can see me. But then you should kinda understand what's going on. This isn't a pretty stance, speed it up. Go up and down, up and down. If you're using a weight, it would look just like this. Up and down. Keeping your elbows up and not down. You have two more sets, I know you can do this. Think how you're gonna feel after the workout. Last set, go eight, go seven, go six, go five, and four, you can do this, and three, and two, and relax. Great job, y'all. We have one more little combo set. Stay with me. This is gonna work hips and abs. You're gonna bring your band so that it's nice and tight. You're gonna put it over your head and we're gonna lean to the left and then back up. And then lean to the left and then back up. So your goal is to try to keep your arms straight. Speed it up, down and up, down and up. So we're gonna do one set slow and one set tempo, and then we're gonna repeat. So now it's slow again, ready? Down for two. See how far you can go, but don't cheat by going forward or backward. Stay to the side. That's it. Now speed it up. Go eight, go seven. Go six and five. So y'all, we are almost done. Let me add in a lower body now. Relax here, good. Bring your arms here, legs in. And what I want you to do is lift the left leg to the side. Let's go, good. Yes. All right, we're gonna just do a little bit of arm movement. Push, push. Last set, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and relax. Arms come back up to the side, but now we're on the other side. Do it again. Do it again. Now speed it up. Go eight, seven, six, 
the obliques as well as the lower back and some nice spinal mobility. Slow it down, please. Down, up, down, up, down, up. Last one. Last sit, speed it. Eight, seven, six, we're almost done, y'all. You're doing amazing. Four, hang in there. Three, two, and relax. Bring your arms in, 90 degree angle. Now I want you to join in with the outer leg lift on the right side. Great. You've got it. If you don't love it, you could do a tap, right? See if you can do this with your toes facing me so that we really work the hip. We have two more sets. Let's add this arms. Push, push. Ooh, when I say we're almost done, we are really, really almost done. All you have is this last set. How about we make it the best? Seven, could you lift the leg a little higher? Come on, go four, go three, go two, and one. All right, take your band and throw it. <laughs> you did great, y'all. I am so, so proud of you. I want you to stretch a little bit before we leave. So we're gonna do a big inhale up. Good and exhale again, inhale and exhale. Now, we're gonna take it down for two and up for two and down for two and up for two. Good, stretching out your back. One more, good, that's it. Let's take our arms to the front, grasp your hands, push forward, and now chin down. Now arms come out, they come behind your back. Grab your hands, stretch your shoulder blades together. Now chin up. And relax. We're gonna lean to the one side, keep your toes forward, stretching the inner thigh. Great. Sit into it maybe a little more. Great, bring it up, reach up tall. Yes, and exhale. And lean it to this side, hold it here. Now we're stretching this inner thigh. Let's sit into it a little more. Good, let's bring our feet all the way in. That's it. S scoop one foot forward, hinge at the hips, and hold it here. Now take your same set hand and reach it as far down as you can. Relax your head. Feet together, roll it all the way up. Good job, and scoop that leg forward, bend down, hold it here, you're doing great. Now take your same side hand, reach down. I see our music has ended. <laughs> that means it is time to end this video. Y'all did so great. How about one big inhale and exhale. Give yourself a big hand, you did amazing. Y'all did so amazing. I am so proud of you. I hope you enjoyed today's workout. If you did, give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button as well. That's helpful for me and you. Also, if you're interested in anything in the, about the video, please read the description under the video. It shows a link where you can buy bands. It shows a link where you could buy my fun little um, slashed pants. <laughs> um, it also has a link on how to join 
my membership group, which I would love for you to do so I connect with you further. If you're interested in the uh, membership group, I highly recommend that you watch this last two minute video. And if you have any questions, you can always comment or email me. So have a great day. See you soon. Bye. Hey y'all. I am so, so excited. I have some great news about my YouTube channel. After posting lots of videos, I am realizing my favorite part, my love, is really connecting through you with your comments and even our Facebook page. So now, there is an easy and great way we can really connect with each other. It's called a YouTube channel membership, and YouTube just approved mine, yay! So, that is why you're seeing a join button right next to the subscribe button on my page. Now please know, my current YouTube channel, Jenny Fitstart, is not going anywhere. It's not going to change and all those videos will still be free to you. But here is the new exciting addition. If you join my membership channel, you will become a part of the group, Jenny's Fit Bunch. Okay, so let me explain what that is. If you click join, you will pay a $9.99 monthly membership fee, just like a gym membership fee, but cheaper. So, what does that give you? Oh my gosh, lots, get ready. Okay, it's the exciting part. First, a live class once a week. Yep, you heard me right, once a week. So each week, you will join me live for a one hour class. Now this will vary, but the format will always include cardio, strength training, and stretching. And guess what, you can comment during the class. How fun will that be? It will feel like you are taking one of my classes in person. And guess what? If you can't make the class, it will be archived into a library so you can do it anytime. This video will only be exclusively for Jenny's Fit Bunch. Okay, second, you get a pre-recorded personal training session once a week. Yes, I will videotape myself leading you through a 30 minute lesson, which will target age appropriate and safe exercises to help with building bone and muscle strength, increase balance, improve posture, aid in weight loss, and increase flexibility. Each week will be fun and different. You will never know what I have up in my sleeves. Now, these private lessons will only be available to Jenny's Fit Bunch. And then third, you get no more mid-roll ads. Yes, those disruptive ads in the middle of my videos will now be turned off on any new videos that I add on this channel. So to review, for only $9.99 a month, you get new videos with no ads, one live fitness class a week, and one recorded personal training session a week. Seriously, that comes out to be close to a dollar a class and a dollar a personal training session. I really did wanna make this affordable. And guess what? You can cancel at any time. Y'all, I promise I am committed to you. I am committed to this new channel and I am committed to helping you get strong, stay happy and healthy and build relationships with all of you. It truly brings me so much joy and with over 28 years experience and being a licensed physical therapist, you will be in safe hands with me. So let's connect. Go to my channel, Jenny Fitstart and click join today. I thank you so, so much from the bottom of my heart. Now, let's have some fun and get moving.